everybody. Welcome to another Coffee Chat. Today we're going to talk about it's all about the experience. Um, by that, I don't mean the amount of life experience you have. Uh, we're talking about when you do things, it's about the experience. It's not about, you know, making other people happy. It is somewhat about making you happy. And sometimes, you know, yeah, you do make other people happy. But overall, you will find that if you enjoy the experience, if you get your full enjoyment out of what you are doing, it works better. It works better. It makes you happier. You, you tend to relax more. It tends to make you, um, make, make you a better person somewhat. I have learned over the years that there are things that I have done, things that I do that I don't enjoy. I don't want to do them. It's not for me. It's not something I've done for me. And really, it's, it really stresses you out sometimes and causes the whole, your, your whole day, your whole week, whatever, to not be an enjoyable week. I have done my best to change that. Recently, I've, I've made a couple more um, couple more decisions to where I'm just going to do things for me and it may or may not hurt some other people's feelings but hey I'm doing it for me I'm doing my life for me to make me happy it's that that's what counts not that I'm trying to offend or upset others but I'm also not going to do everything you know based on what others think of it um, that's part of the experience the other part of the experience is let's not um, let's not take the easy way out sometimes. Uh, it's real easy to go by the, by the fast food place, get you a burger and fries, and go on and go do whatever it is you're going to go do. That is not the most enjoyable thing. We all know that. Now, there are times where you need the fast food fast, quick, something to eat and keep going. But the reality is, if you take the time to sit down and enjoy it, um, it may cost you a little bit more money to do something that's not fast food. But it's going to be more enjoyable. Sit down, have a meal out or at home, cook it in, 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 in over a fire in, in a while, I've done that before, versus the burger and fry fast food. And there are other things that's fast food, just burger fries, the easiest and most recognizable. Uh, just enjoy your experience. Instead of going out and buying that cup of coffee at Starbucks, learn to make it. And I'm not talking about, you know, oh, put, put the water in the pot, put the grounds in, you know, set it and turn it on. That's one way to do coffee, and it's not bad. Have you ever tried cowboy coffee? Uh, Cowboy Kent Rollins is, is well known for doing different things. Cowboy, he always does his things over fire. You can duplicate what he does in, uh, over a stove. Uh, Cowboy coffee, basically you throw grounds in a pot, you boil the water for a little bit, you take it off, let it settle, put a little cold water in to settle the grounds in and pour off the top. Yes, you may get a few grounds in your cup, but you may find that doing that and learning to do that means you may have a better cup of coffee. Personally, I like using the old school percolator pot on the stove. I've got a nice stainless one that does more coffee than I can drink. I'd love to find one smaller. I've uh, tried French press, stuff like that. I mean, learn to make your coffee. Don't go out and buy it overpriced at some place where you, know, you don't even understand what the cup size is or exactly what you're ordering. Yes, there are, there are different types of coffees. There are coffee drinks. There are frou-frou flavored stuff. That's your thing. Go for it. But learn to make it yourself. Do it at home. Um, do it over a campfire out there camping or by the riverbank or something like that. Uh, do it in your backyard over your, own, over your fire pit. It's Learn to do it in a different way. It also might help you out in the, in, in the long run. Let's say, you know, where I live, we get a lot of hurricanes. It means a couple days sometimes the power's out. Uh, the stores don't have, you have, have power to fix your coffee. But if you can do it over fire, there you go. Um, and there are other things, cooking meals, like I said, and, and different things. Just 
get out there and experience things, learn to do things, and don't worry about what others think. It may end up helping you out in the long run and you may feel better about yourself. Alright, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next week.